When Gut gets up and starts fighting Manny, a land mass that had been in the water suddenly erupted, forcing a piece of the ship that Manny and Gut were on to shatter and fall down the land mass. Manny ultimately defeats Gut by smacking him far away with a wood after advancing to the iceberg's edge and causing Gut to fly skyward. Manny falls off the iceberg as a result of the iceberg slipping away from the land mass. He is about to land in the water when Precious, Sid, and Granny save him. Gut is recovering in the meantime, but when he comes across a siren posing as a female Gigantopithecus, he is fatally attacked. Shira joins the herd and becomes Diego's lover while Manny and Diego inform Sid and Granny that they are not failures but heroes. Manny also reconciles with Peaches and is reunited with his family. The other mammoths view Louis as a hero as well and let him to hang out with them. The herd and the other animals eventually discover another continent, where the Hyraxes have also gone, and welcome it as their new home with fresh starts after the continent is destroyed by the landmass. Rat Storyline By sinking into the Earth's core and chasing his acorn around it, Scrat's aim of storing his acorn causes the Pangaea landmass to fragment into the seven continents we know today. Seven continents are formed as a result, and Scrat eventually manages to snag one acorn before being launched out of the Earth's center and landing on a little iceberg that splits in two, severing him from his catch. Lost at sea, Scrat discovers an island and a saber-toothed squirrel's bones. The skeleton points to a chart in the shape of an acorn that goes to an unidentified island full with acorns. Scrat chooses to use the map to locate the island. He is taken prisoner by the same pirates that take Manny, Sid, Diego, and Granny as he sets out on his quest, but he escapes when the ship splits in two. Later, when the pirates have left the herd to seek retribution, Scrat attempts to fly on one of the leaf gliders to begin his quest. However, the wind pushes him against an ice wall before he is eventually able to take off.